Well, last night, Pamela Young shared do-it-yourself beauty maintenance tips while we're all under stay-at-home orders. Tonight, we're hearing from two more local hairstylists on what to do and what not to do. Among the hottest items flying off store shelves lately, toilet paper, bleach, and box hair dye. Hair salons have been shut down for weeks to maintain social distancing measures. With more people staying at home, self-care has turned into do-it-yourself hair coloring and cutting. I asked two local hairstylists the same question. Should people use box hair dye? I've been telling my clients, don't. No. <laughs> How bad can do-it-yourself hair color really be? Sharon Chang and Jake Acido says box color is formulated so anyone can use it, but one size does not fit all. We control what we're putting on our clients, you know, in terms of like the products that we're using. And the box coloring, if you have a specific look that you want to target for the most part, what you see on the pictures might take you a little bit longer, you know, or there's a process to it. Because it has a lot of um, harsh chemicals, a lot of ammonia, and it could break habits to your hair, and you could end up with a huge color correction in the end. Huge color correction means spending more bucks at the salon to fix your hair. Sometimes it's the damage is just so irreversible that you don't want to go in there with more and more chemical. That's the reason why I would not want anyone dyeing their hair with box color, especially if they have previously liked hair or anything, um, just don't do it. In other words, they say best to leave it to the pros. There are sprays you can use to hide dark roots for now, but what about haircuts? I've seen the quarantine haircuts online. Anderson Cooper tried it himself. Oh. Took a, 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 a razor and uh, buzzed my head and I gave myself a giant <laughs> bald spot over here. Most men tend to visit their barbers at least once a month, but now some are resorting to their significant others for help. Ready? Nope. If anything, keep it simple, you know. Um, try not to do like your haircut on yourself. Ne I never advise that, but if you have to, I always say a good trim around the ear hairline. Um, just to keep everything neat looking.